Hello one and welcome back to another episode of Red Dead Redemption 2 uh, in 2021. Right, what is the pelt that I have? Oh, I remember where I was. Uh, this is the Grace family or whatever family. And I had an, an alligator skin. And, uh, yep, I'm fully aware of that. Greetings. Greetings. What do you want, boy? This here the gray plantation? Yep. Gallagher Hall. And that's as close as you're getting to Sheriff's orders. You wanted me to have a word with some folk on the property. I'm recently deputized, you see. Deputized? Mm -hmm. And I suppose Lee was drunk when he did it? Look, you can come in, but you ain't talking with me. Obliged. Sure. Ask around at Caliga Hall to find out more about the Grace. Sure thing. You coming in or what? I'm already in, pal. someone who could tell me about this place? Well, the wages are crap and the conditions are worse. Try but Wait. Of course, every time. Saw him over by the Dove Coast there. It's his family on the place. Okay. Okay, my girl. I'm guessing the he's back here. Hello. Hello. Anyone out here? There it is. Hey, pal. Huh. I'll see you at the sheriff's office. Excuse me, friend. We friends? Not yet, but he is hoping. I guess. <laughs> we don't get a lot of traveling men here. And suddenly, there's a whole phalanx of, of mysterious love. but strangely helpful Yankees about the place. Is there? What are you doing here? I was just looking for work. Well, looking for something. Don't worry, your secret's safe with me. What secret? I got a secret of my own. Are you secretly normal? Excuse me? Never mind. <laughs> the thing is, I don't care if you kill the whole lot of us and the Braithwaites. I don't want to kill anyone. I love her, you know. <laughs> love who? Penelope. But it's impossible. Well, love tends to be complicated. She's a Braithwaite. I'm Bo Ooh. Gray, son of Tavish Gray, nephew of Lee Gray, the sheriff, grandson of old Murdo Gray. We Grays okay. have been loyal to the state and murderers to the Braithwaites for so long now, no one can even quite explain why. Beyond blind loyalty and stupidity, I'm Sounds supposed to be loyal right. to some nonsense while she, she's amazing. She's like a woman from the future. She's like tomorrow, if tomorrow turns out fine. Well, <clears throat> I'm sorry for your predicament. Would you help? I don't want to get involved in <laughs> gang feuds. It seems unseemly. I'll pay. I've got money. We grays, we've always got money. No yeah. brains mine, but money. Well, in that case. <laughs> no I know she loves to sit out in the gazebo on the edge of the Braithwaite property. Take her this letter and this bracelet, please. All right. Oh, look out for their guards. They're worse with strangers than ours are. Okay, it seems that we get a sneak in. Let's go. So long. And good luck. Thank you, I guess. Hey, don't ruin the place. Hey, you better fall out of Oh, shut up. This poor thing is not doing so well. You're a brain girl. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. She definitely deserves some place to. Oh, by the way, uh, this episode is probably going to be relatively short compared to the others. Around 40, 40 
45 minutes because I gotta get going pretty soon. So we'll see how long we can get into this quest. Exactly. Okay. There are a bunch of them around. Whoa, 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 whoa. Show me him. Just appeared out of nowhere. I think I kind of screwed up the gold. At best, I might be able to get a silver. See another one there. That's him. Where is she? Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, 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 shit. shit. Talk to her before she freaks out. Are you Penelope Braithwaite? Well, I guess I am. I've got a letter for you. Oh. And a gift. <laughs> a letter and a gift. Well, we don't even know each other. <laughs> well, it's not from me. It's from. Uh... From Bo. <gasps> oh, he is so. Strange. Stupid, though. <laughs> yes, he's a little strange, but. Also so human. The rest of our families are stuck in the dark ages or well, I don't know, cave people perhaps. Mm, Both nice different. <laughs> but if they find out, they'll kill him and send me to live someplace awful like Ohio. Have you ever been to Ohio, sir? No. Well, neither have I, but my uncle has a factory there. He was sort of the black sheep on account of having left. But now they tolerate him because he's a vicious snob. Families are are there's something else. <laughs> you got a family, sir? No, not really. Well, they tolerate him because of the money. But me, with my ideas above my station, they can't stand. That sounds pretty complicated. I I don't know quite what to say. Well, nothing to say except I hope they all rot. <laughs> I don't, uh, well, maybe a bit, but here, if you see Bo again, will you give this to him? Sure. Okay. Ooh, leave the area. 
Uh, I would say you can either get the hell out from where you came in or you can do something better. Please tell me I can use this thing. Hello? There we go. I had to press E without the game telling me. about huh look at that is it near our camp yeah it is it's, that's a camp there's that one or those islands I've never been to these islands I don't think so well that's somewhere to take a look at whoa 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 come on out girl within three minutes. Uh, in fact, since that I'm American Red Fox, I haven't seen that one before. There were one or two challenges that I was like, yeah, I can do that pretty easily. But I forgot what they were. Herbalist. That one is the berry thing. This one, yes, carry someone. This. Call an animal and get a clean kill five times. No rate. Okay. There we go. Uh, snipe? Was it snipe for deer? kill too many uh, quickly because the game is not going to like that. And I'm going to just carry this to the camp. Or, got a better idea, got my second horse nearby. Oops. Sorry. No, 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 no. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I meant to, to pat. What the hell? Why didn't the other horse come by? Come on. Come on, you dumb.
didn't work out. Why is it not coming? That's weird. Finally! Now, girl. Yeah. All right. So here's a plan. Gonna donate the alligator skin and you don't look the meat. Right dressed in the law. How are you, Miss Karen? Fine. How are you, Mr. Bill? Yes, the one in Valentine. Well, give me the information. <laughs> no, I'm running this. You want in? Well, <laughs> you? <laughs> me. I can rob a bank just as well as any of you. Okay. Sure, maybe. Well, let me have a think. I've been working on this a long time. I'm not getting cut out. We could really use some more meat, Mr. Morgan. Okay, okay, okay. Perfect. Pose him, not sure if I need to have him out. Five out of five. Make sure you get a good price for it. Badger. Okay. Oh yes, I'll be able to make you something out of this. This is all donating. Thank you. All right, now four pelts. Uh, I need quite a lot more than that, actually. Ah, Alligator. Now I could turn this into something special. Deer pelt and deer carcass. Okay. Many thanks, Mr. Morgan. And you know, Arthur, I can always make you a new statue of the on space. Elk and panther. Bison and raccoon, beaver. Beaver and raccoon are the small animals that I want. Arthur. Arthur. Perfect alligator skin. Wait. You deserve it, Mr. Morgan. Uh, ram carcass, cougar pelt, perfect ox. Yeah, I remember about that one. This one needs. Ooh, I need one more for pelt. Do I need only it? one more? Hello. Look like I'm huh. doing. It looks like you're reading. And I am. How do you ask? Just campfire. Miss Wolf. Beaver. Muskrat. Skep campfire. Perfect goat. Or nothing. Okay. A few changes never hurt. Hey, Arthur. You all right? Yeah, I like this spot. It's a shame we never robbed that bank Arthur. in Valentine, though. Yeah, I guess it is. Okay. Are you gonna give me... Well, anyway, I won't disturb you. All right, Arthur. Well, you could have given me the quest, you know. All right, uh, let's there, go back to our lover and tell him the news. Come on, run, Arthur. Come on. Come on, come on. Okay, girl. Ah, makeup. Or Mr. Asshole. Yep. What was that noise? graphics look good in this one. This is back in 2018. I don't think this would have gained much from ray tracing. You won't. You okay? 
<laughs> Don't think so. Do I look okay? <laughs> no. You look awful. <clears throat> awful. Look at me. Useless. Don't remember. I wasn't born to this. Either. I didn't deserve this. I used to be a gentleman. Jeremiah Compson. Compson stead. Good for you. If that's anything to boast about. They took everything from me. Who did? They. And what did they take? My whole life. A whole way of living a career. I stole a lot of things, but that's quite a lot to steal. Look at me here, <laughs> living in the shit and in the mud. I'm sorry. <laughs> my old house. The house my grandfather built. Huh. It's all dilapidated and destroyed, repossessed by the bank. I'm sorry to hear that. I was supposed to live a different life. Well, as soon as you fucked Me it up. Me too. If only I could get my old things back. Personal mementos, a watch, old pistol, my ledger. Where's this house again? Compson Stead. It's a, north of Scarlet Meadows. Hmm. Banks says I can't go near it. I'm living rough over by Aris Field. Well, if I'm ever out that way, I'll see what I can do. Time. Time is hell. Okay. This poor fella need, seems to be needing some help, so we're gonna give him some. But meanwhile, there's one other side quest here. Okay, that was a bit further than I expected. You okay there, mister? You need me to move? Move? I am. I'm sitting in the wrong place. Excuse me? I didn't mean any offense, sir. Please. I don't get your meaning. I'm very sorry, sir. You have yourself fine day, and I apologize for any offense I may have inadvertently caused. What are you drinking, mister? Nothing, sir. Nothing at all. Why are you acting so strange? I don't mean to. I'm sorry for any offense. How could you have offended me? I have no idea. But I had no idea how I offended the last fellas. And they stole my wagon on account of my impudence. Stole your wagon for back check? Mm, they didn't like my medical practice, I suppose. I was helping folk. And that wasn't popular? I was undercutting the competition. Ah. Or I was too colored. Or I was irritating in nature. Or I was some know-it-all big city slicker here to demean some good old boys of my fine words. The exact variety of my sins was the source of some conjecture, so they undercut me. That ain't very nice. That was my impression. <laughs> Still, compared to the gutting, Castration, defenestration, and crucifixion they offered me. <laughs> I felt I got off lightly. Imaginative bunch. Yes. But no great love of my medical practice. Too free with my wisdom and services. Which way they go? Down the road, that away. Stay here. Okay, I'm sort of forced to. Please don't go to any trouble on my account. Mm-hmm. Yeah, this one seems a lot more fun. Because we're gonna. Are you looking for that fella's wagon? I heard him say they was taking it to Macomb's Inn. Okay, thanks. Okay, let's get going then. Move out of the dark way. <laughs> There's probably gonna be a chance to buy the wagon. Or kill the bunch and take the wagon. And I'm gonna choose the killing for those assholes because they deserve it. Yes, me. Yeah. 
go easy like that some plans of coming back to this place at some point. So do not steal someone's wagon for helping people. Look at that. What do we got? Nice. 20 bucks, not bad. And food for the horse too. Inspect here. Okay. If you say so. Oh, let's get going. Okay, come on. Get you back to the dock. Huh, snake. Not a perfect one. I need ten of them or something. Yep. you killed a poor horse, asshole.
Things and just get the hell out. Oh, look who it is. I did not count on seeing that wagon again. Nor you, for that matter. The only people you won't be seeing are the folks who took it. Uh, I take it they aren't the only ignorant bullying clodhoppers in these parts. But I can live in glorious hope. Ah, it wasn't a trouble now, was it? No, it was a pleasure. Yeah. Let me give you something for your pleasure. Ah. What it's just going to be some material, not money. Ah, how about this? Provide a man a tincture, he'll be well for a day. Teach him to make one, he oh. might be well a while longer. Well, I'll make sure to try and make this. Thank you. <sighs> Thank you. It won't work for anything chronic, but you may not need it to. Well, if you see me on my travels and you're in need of something, make sure you come and say hello. Travel safe now. Be safe, sir. All right, that was a fun one. Now, wow, that's a lot of honor. <laughs> okay, special health cure. Okay. And so, as I said, this is gonna be a shorter episode than normal and I gotta start to get going. So I'm gonna save the game and finish this episode here. But I hope you enjoyed this episode. And if you did, please don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment. It would be so much appreciated. And I'll catch you on the next one. Take care, everyone. Bye for now.